atmosphere in Israel or in the stream. <coughs> okay, continue. Okay. Um, so we have objectives here. Oh, glass darkly. Access Dr. Calvino's workshop. View on the map. Hardware lamps. Hardware lamps. Above the lobby. Okay. That's the Calvino's workshop. Oh, right. It was over there. transition okay Nick tactics the hell? Beam spare parts, metal required. That thing was dangerous. No, I wanted suit repair. Nice screen. Hardware director, no code. Hope Alice, baseball glove, lemon peel, big bag candy, wrench. Let's repair kit. Hello, Dave. You are my only hope. Hey, I sent Larson to the demo theater to see if he can sneak a bottle of old soda. Join us? Oh, just heads up on that Artax propulsion system demo. will have to be delayed. We're still working on a slight collaboration issue in the machine shop, but there's nothing to worry about. Raised wire, plastic tubing. Projector. Damn. Um, that person seemed to be very unlucky. And royal glue canister. More T. 
Okay. Too far, too fast, too. And Johnson's term came to an end, paving the way for President Reagan. Even then, the space race was showing signs of faltering, the eager push from previous decades being dulled by a lack of advancement that space has seemed to promise. The Soviet Union had already suffered economic collapse through similar space focus. Many in Washington and the Pentagon found further spending on the space program unpopular, giving rise to a wave of politicians, many of whom had also successfully prevented US involvement in Vietnam, but focused on solving problems at home. But the cost of these Mars installations and their continued maintenance is staggering, and the Spartan shells are a far cry from the idyllic colonies pictured by turn-of-the-century inspirational space tourism posters. All that might be about to change in a rare interview, Transstar President Alex Yu reveals his vision of a Mars where families in short sleeves can picnic in a grassy field and pick out the point of light that is Earth after the sun sets. Enabling this vision requires terraforming Mars, the most challenging engineering problem the human race has ever faced. You present an innocuous grey Mars to me, an extreme file organism designed specifically for that purpose, dubbed Takakia Catherine. The simple looking plant is actually a fantastically efficient organic machine that given enough centuries will convert the Martian atmosphere into something that very much resembles our own. The United States' dominance of the first operational space elevator, the White Stork Tower, has allowed them to control almost all orbital activities and commerce. Now the rest of the world is playing catch-up. The World Union of Space Industry, WUSI, has calculated that using the Stork facility to aid in construction of a second space elevator would result in construction costs that are... Yeah, I've read that one already. I'm gonna throw a sharp spacecraft at someone. Asteroid fragment, really? Where is that guy? Okay, that didn't work. Disintegrated circuit. <sighs> Explosive canister. Okay. Next time I'll throw it at something. How do I open it? Caution, keep clear. Phantom. Yeah, I know. What exactly are phantoms? I don't get it yet. People converted or something? No key card. Allen pistol ammo fabrication plan. Crew. Weapon upgrade kit. Silenced pistol. Can we upgrade the silenced pistol? That's not a lot of firepower. Accuracy, definitely accuracy. I have another one? I have a, no, I don't have another one. Um, auto sort. That's upside hypo. Q beam cells. Q-beam weapon. Neuromod. Hmm, 
physician. Dismantle. Destroy the operators. That could be useful. Okay, so cycling in with the stamina cost. I'm thinking dismantle. At least now, I have a weapon. Um, Hardware lands, yeah. What did we say we want? There you map. Cool. Atrium. Kyoti. Dr. Calvino's workshop. A point of dispenser. Power kiosk. Okay. So, Dr. Calvino. Security controls. Unlock security locker. Dr. Calvino. Dr. Lorenzo Calvino. No life signs. Can you see it? Scanning target, no alien material detected. Typhon contaminant found. Error. Attitude adjustment required. No space to deploy and deploy. Ready to scan. <clears throat> Electric junction. Does that help me in any way? That's a neuro mod. Okay. Uh... Yeah, that was supposed to teach me... Uh, I fell. Yeah, that was supposed to teach me how to use the glue gun... ...to get places. Let me move the bullets. Let's repair employee entrance... ...and... Bourbon. The hell? Um, point the other way. Mark submitted. Can you switch this to be number two? This? Number two. Okay. Better. Get all the beer and bourbon. And the food tin. 
Okay. Let me open. Deploying. What is that, Phantom? I'm in the atrium. Diagnostic check. Verbose. Verbose. Nominal power load. Nominal. A lot of the station tech starts here. Lab equipment, special parts requests, prototypes. We should be able to fix your looking glass terminal from Dr. Calvino's workshop. Deploying. Checking for updates. Servers offline. Oh shit, that worked. And it killed my turret. Oh no, Birchman, sorry. Oh, and second bone. Yeah, take everything. I have no room. Huh. Okay, put the wrench away. Give me that. Show me. Good modification. Request for an inventory size. Upgrade the gun. Give me better range. Let's suit repair and then pick up everything. God damn it, auto sort. I need to get back to my lab to dismantle things. Have don't even have room for crumpled paper. Eat. Okay, I'm going back to recycle stuff. Yeah, I got through the conferencing center and executive offices and my recycler. Transfer junk. Auto sort. Transfer the bourbon. Also the beer and the wine. Okay. What can I make with this? Oh, I forgot to, to do the wrench. Move the wrench. Glug. 
glue canister, 9mm bullets. How many can I carry? Doesn't say. What does it say on the glue canister? Let's make more of these. Okay, create. Okay, let's see how that looks. Necropsy required. Why the hell didn't I have your pistol? And I have two pistols. Let's recycle the pistol. Doesn't seem like the materials are taking much space. Actually, put it down, it might be useful over here. Can we turn this off? Thank you. Yeah, this is busted. Can I just turn this thing off? Okay. Who's, who's talking? Chemical lab. That's not exactly an elevator. Reployer. Ah, oh my god, that hurt. Tape drive. Can I turn you off or anything? Of course, Dr. Calvino's lab is locked. Calvino probably has a key card. You can locate him, or what's left of him, with the security roster. Yeah, that's that's what I did. Hang on. I have a 
bit of a cold, I'm sorry. Okay. Hmm. There's a hidden passageway. Maintenance access panel? Hello. I am in the machine shop. Oh, we have a semi-optional turret. Something's broken. I will have found you. Disintegrated circuit. Now new will open instructions. Ah! It's shutting you down. If you want to know something else. Transar Cobalt 410 Engineering Class Operator ready to deploy. Inspect and clear suit sufferers of wear and tear. Ooh. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Maybe I should go to medical. Your decision is how they did that. Conveyor controls. Uh huh. Help me. Every airlock has a manual seal you'll have to disengage before you can space walk. While engineered as a safety measure, it's irrelevant when the enemy is already inside the station. If you do go out there, I wouldn't stray far. The Typhon may have spread to the exterior. And remember, other airlocks you find will have to be opened from the inside first. Last thing, you don't have a propulsion system for your suit yet. Vital signs critical. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Oh. Holy crap. Uh, can you fix my suit? Inspecting. Your suit suffered some wear and tear. Oh. Fix that. Thank you. Coming through. Yeah, I'm out of ammo. Shotgun shells. Watch out. Excuse me. What did it drop? Operator approach. Broken cooler fan. Neural mod. Nothing is still dangerous. And I don't have the repair skill. Engineer. Have repair one. Explore can grab shafts, fabrications, and recyclers. Dismantle. Good modification. 
Yes. Yes. Can I fix that thing over there? Oh my god! Does that help? I think it helps. I need repair too. Great. Everything's off. Everything is off. What does this say? Log every time you enter the maintenance call space through the access panel. Leaky pipe fixed. Unexplained light flicker. Unable to locate source. Power good. Okay. <coughs> Electrical device near machine shop door unstable. Used local adhesive for temporary fix. Note in case of emergency, head into the maintenance call space via the small access panel. Shut off local power. Notify me immediately. Yeah, I think I kind of need power. That's a light. That's a busted to it. Need a repair to the fix you saw. Internal lock. No lock unlocked. Yeah, more food. This is off. Max speed MG V2, yeah, that's a very known formula. We have a recycler. No, that's a fabricator and that's a recycler. Okay, transfer all the junk. Transfer... Shotgun shells. Repair, suit repair kit. Air parts. Okay, try to learn things. one glue. Okay. Ooh, materials. What? What the hell broke? Email. Bolt effectiveness. Don't sweat it. Nikola, I'm sorry for the bolts all over the machine shop. It's really the only place I can try out the new gun. I think it's coming along rather nicely. Still want to help? I've already recruited Mary. Don't sweat it. When the cat's away and all that, I think I have a few ideas. I'll draw something up and send it to you and Mary. Psychotronic satellite? Satellite presently in the repair bay of the machine shop is scheduled to be decommissioned 
However, Dr. Kjellstrup has requested that we remove the psychotronic transistor elements and install them in a new satellite. I don't know what they do, so don't bother asking. Just get it done. Can I push this thing? Station around the moon. Not around the earth. The moon. What the hell's going on over here? Nope. Great. Too heavy. And it's the only way. Um, stop that. And can you burn yourself out? I guess that's as good as I get. Keeping and whirring. What do we have here? Storage room. Don't have the key. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the hell? Radiation. Um... No, that's not gonna work. Where the hell did you go? Sneak attack! What the hell is that thing? EMP charge! An effective against robots towards and other electrical based enemies can be thrown or fixed stationary objects. Interesting idea. Yeah, radiation. Blue, weapon upgrade. Clive, we need to up the reload speed on the glue cannon. The actuators are slow on this thing. Yeah. Can I upgrade my gun again? With slightly more firepower. Wrong button. Uh, yeah, the radiation. Can you unlock this thing? Thank you. That was required. The door malfunction requires repair three, which I do not have. But I can recycle some more stuff. Okay. 
Okay. 90 is the max. Okay. For one slot. Yeah, nothing else I have to. 276. Wait, so he's counting every bullet? There's no way to get there. No way I'll make that jump. Nice. Nice. Trash can. Oh, trash can. Yeah, why are you still using trash cans if you have recyclers? Tax fabrication plan. Oh, Transtown Uniform Guide. Excerpt from Transtown New Hires material. Your Transtown uniform has been designed for your safety, comfort, and to facilitate your work. The uniform must be worn at all times while on board the station. While every effort has been made to make Talos a comfortable and safe place to work, there is always the chance of an accident or hazard. Dep departmental assignments can be determined by uniform style and color. Brown and Black, Corporate Administrative, Green and White, Science and Technology, Orange, Engineering and Maintenance, Blue and Black, Security. Okay. Artax Propulsion System. A microgravity maneuvering which can be attached to your Transtar uniform also assists with jumps in normal gravity. Cool. Slightly effective, but I can do this and kind of glide. I wonder if there's a specific place I need to use the phone. Hello. Inspecting. Your suit meets regulation. Thank you. Okay. Lorenzo Calvino. Okay, that doesn't last. Let's not waste ammo. What do we have over here? Demonstration stage. Where's the Phantom? Can't throw that far. You come out. Live Lawrence's corpse. Huntress Boltcaster. Hello. Is 
that a... Those rock crystal launchers foam darts which do zero damage, also no possibility to annoy co-workers, decide enemies and remotely trigger buttons and screens. <laughs> oh my god, this is ridiculous. It's a nerf weapon. Let's put your zero. Fucking nerf weapon. That's another recycler. Sure, let's recycle some more stuff. Why can't I shove big things in there? Thermal shielding, 19.4 gigahertz, and resistance to fire damage. Cool. The cycloscope can be upgraded with chipsets. It provides various benefits, boosts, and protections. Install chipsets, understood chipsets, and scope chipsets pages with the inventory tab of your transcribe. Use plastic tubing, just so we're clear. Always look behind stuff. Necropsy. What the hell do I get? Necropsy. What is necropsy? Dentist? Necropsy. I need five for that. Ooh, makes exotic material. But wait, I can get position now. No? Don't I have on your mod? I used it. Take the glue gun. Dr. Thorstein, where are you? Machine shop, I was just... I, I heard an explosion. Forget that. Grab whatever you can and get to my office. We're evacuating. What? What should I have? Neuromods, exotic material, just hurry. Meet me in my office. Yes, sir. And bring a glue gun. Okay. Where were you going from here? There's nothing here. Dump the junk. Dump this. And yeah, I think that's it. Hello, demo room. Okay. What is upstairs? Like, sorry, I can't fix you. Yo, Kabe. Hey, it's Langley. 
wait, are you, uh, is there anything weird going on over there? No, like what? I don't want you to panic. What is going on, Langley? Not sure yet. Security's running all over the place. So, everyone's still working there? I guess, I don't know. I've been in the lab all day, hang on. I'm looking now. I don't... You? Oh my god, I think we just lost two labs. What? I have to go. Hello. Star Pyramid 490 Medical Class Operator ready to deploy. Please stand clear of aperture. Whoa. Didn't miss anything. Okay. You guys are disgusting. Wait, oh, no, no, the other access panel. Hello. Um. Right. Okay. Here we have the radiation leak. And nothing else of interest. Nobody caught whatever fell off of that. And then here to Noel. Oh, down here to someone. Platform? What platform? Oh! Right. If I climb up here, maybe I can do it. Yes. What is that? What the hell is that? Are those solar panels? Never mind. Okay. Let's get back to it. Okay, I've been in there. I came out. I climbed up. I went Welcome. in there. Maybe I can help you. You did. Thank you. Nothing's burned to shit. Beams and waves lamp, combustion lamp. Uh, that side of the lab was breached. Hard vacuum. 
no gravity. There's an exterior airlock in the machine shop you could use to reach him. Um... Why is that specific section have no gravity? Okay, will breach beyond this point. Yeah... Yeah, I don't want to use a canister on a mimic. But I would use it on a phantom. Ah, it's still alive. Lunch. <laughs> to do it like right jail eels sunburst banana asteroid fragment baseball glove note hello my name is mr gluey mcglue face uh here's the cigar Asteroid Fireman, Baseball Glove. Ish, you people are bored. Feed this to an ENG operator after you memorize Group Workstation's password macro. You win. To whomever gave dear Mr. Gluey McGlue face arms, aka first shift, I bow to thee. At first thought, the jail, jellied eel hat could not be topped. I stand corrected. Your triumphant creation of baseball glove hands cannot be equ equaled. The unworthy second shift. <laughs> if you need supplies, this is a reminder that if you need supplies on the machine shop, the supply closet key code is 8200. If you take anything, please let me know. The machine shop supply closet. Glue test results. Specimen, blah blah blah. Adhesion test. Test specimen preparation. The dimensions shall be optimized for small scale test chambers. One square meter. Operating at 1 to 0 0.02 air change per hour to achieve the loading factor of 0 0.01 to 9 meters squared. Applied TVO 79C to clean stainless steel sheet metal plate. Early coated specimen on sheet metal plate successfully with occurrence of minimal waste. Immediately transferred specimen to conditioning environment. Small, test, small scale test successful. Recommend moving to full scale. Note glue is still vitreophobic. What is vitreophobic? Vitreophobic. Vitreous is glass, so you can't you can't use it to adhere to glass. Yep. These stations are so old school. Another wrench.
Make sure you keep highlighted. Hardware lamps, yeah. No entry. You will fall. Demonstration theater, hardware lamps. Oh yeah, that's the entrance. I really love the design of all this thing. Nikki Tano. Yeah, weapon upgrade. I should probably use it, right? Do I need to upgrade the glue gun? Glue gun. Handling. Increased movement speed. Reload speed. Yes. I can't upgrade that. Fine, well, I can't dismantle that. If I dismantle that, I get one spare part. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, and you have plenty of spare parts. Coffee. Cooking with cauliflower. Renowned for its versatility and lush aroma, cauliflower can be substituted in many traditional recipes to boost their nutritional payload without compromising on flavor. Ox, mashed potatoes, pizza crust, cauliflower, rice, pellets, and more. But if you're looking to maximize the health benefits of this dimpled delicacy, then steaming is your best bet. Go for the purple variety if you really want to add a blast of color to your plate. Steaming is an interesting idea. We'll put eel scrap and, and apple peel in the, in the microwave. Jeez, people. How do I reach that section? No. Thaddeus, please keep an eye on Franklin. The man spends far too much time on personal projects and recreational pursuits. We're all human here, I get it, but I'm worried he may try to use the propulsion system to access unauthorized areas. Hey, this is Gus down in Cargo Bay. I found something curious in an outbound container on my shift. I think it's a fabricator plan for an autonomous turret. It was stashed with a bunch of old capacitor cells slated for delivery to the Pythias facility. Might have been an accident, but I don't know. One of the officers put it in the safe in the life support security station. He wanted back to talk to them. Dr. Calvino isn't feeling well enough to present the latest looking glass tech to our visitors, so I'll be away from the labs for an extended period. I've left everything in working order while I'm out, just in case I'm sending you the keycode to my office, it's 4141. Didn't anyone tell you not to just dole out your office codes? Your passwords? I looked at that person, right? But I missed the hard drive. What's the deal with the hard drive? It's a fine hard drive. Forty forty one forty one forty one. It's a very interesting office you have here. I wouldn't want this office. Oh, that's the office. That's the office. Uh, 
I think that's the director of the lab. Hmm. I have the sense he resented you. Unfortunate. Yeah, well, he was alien. He was infected by an alien. Then. My new employer. I just wanted to write to you personally and thank you for the new employer. I know some people have been on waiting list to get one of these, and it was a pleasant surprise to find a new one in my office this morning. It is this feeling of gratitude that makes it awkward for me to travel you further. However, if you could spare one of your engineers for a bit, it would be great if they could swing by and show me exactly what it does. <laughs> Art acquisition. Wanted to clear a Morgan request again. Morgan was down in hardware today, just standing there as if not sure where to go. And when I offered to help, Morgan asked for more operator parts. Asked if the last ones we sent hadn't been sufficient, and I got a blank look. I mean, no offense, but Morgan's requisitioned enough to repair any operator in the station five times over now, and we have other operators that need maintenance. That's because Morgan isn't up to speed, and someone is preventing Morgan from having memories. I don't have the code to that safe. And I probably can't break it. The space elevator. Yeah. Aha. My inventory is again almost full. And I need more ammo. What is this place? Thank you, Metric Sphinxy, for following. Much appreciated. Where the hell am I now? I can move through the glass. Yeah, someone fudged up. Oh, that's the entrance. Oh, okay. I wanted to strip this one. Yes. And this one. And this one. Okay, so I have this access now. Always look behind everything. I am out of freaking room. Remember, there's a wrench. need to be back in the hardware labs, do some recycling. I've been all over the place here. Yeah, and I need to get through the other side. No, I'm going to head down. Thank you. Now, through here. Yeah, there's a recycler. There's also a recycler in there. So, this is still locked. But if I go through here. There's a maintenance bot. I said 
maintenance bot. I can fix my suit. Inspecting. Your suit suffered some wear and tear. I'll fix that. Repair complete. I'm right here. Thank you. Now back up over here. And recycle. And recycle this, and recycle this, and this, and this, and salt. And this. We don't have any beer here, right? Cigars. No. Frozen unagi rolls? Biscuit eel meat. Cool. Okay. Lemon pie. Beer. Transfer the beer. Okay. Now recycle that. Excellent. Now I want a milk kit. I have six milk kits. It's a bit pricey. But I think I mostly want ammo now. Held in inventory 92. Let's stick with 92 for now. Okay. Uh, save. Talos 1 has multiple airlocks which lead to the exterior of the space station. Before you can use them, you have to disengage their manual seals on the inside. The more airlocks you find, the more freedom you'll have to navigate through and around the station as you wish. Access your transcribe to view your station map to find more airlocks. I need to go out and right and up. How do I get station map? I'm guessing that's an airlock. Guts. What is guts? Yeah, I saw these rotating rings or something. Objective. Airlock. Air locked. Yeah, okay. Let's go. I guess. I hope there are no aliens outside. Yeah, it's a huge station. It's got artificial gravity. Microgravity detected. Your Transtar suit is equipped with a propulsion system to navigate the harsh environment of space. To navigate the zero-g, use the first keys Rust and A to boost, XV to break. You can use space to ascend and alt to descend. Hold V or X to roll. Okay. Holy crap, do I have air reserves? Yeah, can't have that. Psychotronics, Dr. Calvino's office. Holy crap, this is so spooky. What? Is someone talking to me? Oh, there's an operator.
Let's grab that. Was the shotgun? That's a no two bottle. Reach fail safe control panel broken. Dr. Calvino. Mills, this is Dr. Calvino. What's up? I'm feeling ill. I am not myself today. I think I won't be in for my shift at all. Okay. Do you still want me to finish this array? I fabricated a shit ton of glass. Array? I don't recall. You asked me to set up a new array. You must have misunderstood are you honestly i prefer if you left my experiments alone in my absence uh well look i have a message you left me seriously i would not have made all of this if you hadn't no no of course i uh, i remember now uh, let's just uh, for the time being yeah it doesn't matter <laughs> it doesn't matter <laughs> let's talk about it too. You found him. Not surprising. Well done. Wait. Was the audio log? Mio, uh, this is um, this is Doctor Calvino. Ah, well, I suppose you've turned in, uh, or you're ignoring me. Uh, I just want to. Well, I, I will be a little late for my shift tomorrow, but um, uh, the, the first thing in the morning, I want you to put together a new micro lens array. You see, the, the old one is it's garbage. And uh, get what you need from the machine shop. And if Clive is being an ass, just take it from the supply closet when he's not looking. Uh, we're not supposed to know the code, but, uh, well, uh, I'm sending it to you anyway. Mio, this is Dr. Calvino. What's up? I'm feeling ill. I'm not myself today. I think I won't be in for my shift at all. Okay. Do you still want me to finish this array? I fabricated a shit ton of glass. Array? I don't recall. You asked me to set up a new array. You must have misunderstood. Are you... Honestly, I prefer if you left my experiments alone in my absence. Uh, well, look, I have a message you left me. Seriously, I would not have made all of this if you hadn't... No, no, of course. I, uh, I remember now. I, uh, let's just, uh, for the time being, yeah, it doesn't matter. <laughs> it doesn't matter? Uh, let's talk about it tomorrow. <sighs> Only transfer operators are at your service. Medical operators can heal you and remove harmful traumas. 
How do you know in operators we store your turn to store your integrity? Something about science operators. Doesn't matter, but she fabricated a shit ton of glass. Looking glass workshop. Stop it with the banging. Something was moving. The hell is that a? What the hell is? That looks intelligent. What the hell is that? Am I getting a vignette effect? I think I am. What the hell is going on? Where is that? Holy shit! Diagnostic. All messed up. Whoa. That's cool. Okay, what else do we actually have here? Examine. Looking glass power on. Hang on a minute. Engineering control systems. There's a metaphor here, you know. Typically, the objective of control theory is to monitor the output of a system and compare it to the desired output, the reference signal. The difference between the actual and desired outputs, the error signal, is applied as feedback to the input of the system to bring the actual output closer to the reference. Good control systems and good engineers learn from the past. Yeah, I think I've read that one too. Yeah, it's all looking glass. But isn't the point that it only works for one person? Because it projects something based on your own vision? Yeah, needs power. Why are they arrayed like that? Prototype looking glass. Connection lost. But it is cool. Video playback. Test phase one. Could not connect to host. You refer to stop server connectivity. Online. Online. Ten eighteen. Ten 
Restored. Nice work, Morgan. The looking glass screens are online again. Head back to your office as soon as you can. It's important you hear the rest of your message. I'll meet you there. One twelve. Um, one one twelve. Fourteen six ninety six. Diagnostic. Diagnose network servers. All servers are online. Diagnose LG screens. All screens intact. It's running? Light field capture looks a little hot. Where's the photometer? The handheld. D did you take it? No. That's a bit too loud. Ah, yesterday we had two, now I can't find one. We've only ever had one. Nonsense. I guess you forgot. I faced you. That's so cool. You're leaving? Uh, I thought we were done. No, just, just turn it off then. I feel like you're upset with me. No, I, uh, I suppose it's, it's late after all. Uh, go, go, uh, sleep. What about you? What about me? Yeah, don't concern yourself. I'll finish. Right. I guess I'll see you later then. Yeah, you guess. What? <laughs> you're always saying, I guess. That worked, I guess. I'll see you later, I guess. You're a scientist. Stop guessing. No. Or be quiet. Yeah, that's all. <laughs> Good night, Dr. Calvino. <sighs> I have no idea what that is. But I can understand his point of view. Also, my gun is going through the looking glass. I don't think that's intended. What are you doing? Also, something is wrong with him. Obviously. Oh, can I open it? He opened it. He did something to it. Also, this thing is pretty freaking weird. So yeah, what happened here? Looks like a breach. Holy hell. Yeah, exterior breach. Ballistics lab, no key card. My cyclone charge. Breach beyond this point. Yeah, it's above me. I, I went out. Aim Schmidt Ballistics Lab Keycard Recycler Challenge 
What is a recycler charge? When detonated, the recycler charge breaks down the molecular structure of nearby objects into recyclable material. Your uniform offers some degree of protection but is not fail safe. Turning to close can prove hazardous. Recycler charge can be thrown or fixed. Okay. That's number five. That's number four. Okay. Welcome to the ballistics lab. Those suckers contained. Why are the f dithering oh, I'm doing that? Yeah, tell me what's up. Lily, I was testing the recycler charge and something peculiar happened. I placed the usual source material into the chamber and set off the charge. Mixed in with the result was something I've never seen before. A purple, almost organic looking substance. Maybe something contaminated the source material? I'm unsure how to proceed, so I've placed the unidentified material in the safe for now. I've been informed you are in need of an updated recycler charge fabrication plan. It just so happens I have a spare plan in my quarters. Remind me before next shift, I'll break it down. I guess you found a mimic when you did that. Yeah, lots of material in here. Why aren't you recycling used cigars? A frayed wire. Some corroded coils. And all the fried hard drives. Breach failsafe. Wow. Get that thing out of here. Oh, Lily, new code, 4866. Yep. Exploration. That is how you win. Forty-eight sixty-six. Exotic material. How do I drop a charge on you? You don't have a recycler here? In memoriam, right hallux. Date of incident, October 21st, 2034. Employee, Lily Morris. Recycler charge went off with my foot in range. The organic material that was once a part of me is now neatly compacted into the sphere you see before you. Take heed. Ugh. Still useful. <laughs> Yields marble. Marble, concrete, wood, tungsten, rubber, epoxy, carbon fiber, cardboard. Aluminum, brass, glass, iron, copper, cobalt. Ballistic chamber. Requirements, chamber seal, recycler, or EMP charging grenade container. Where is the grenade container? Release recycler charge. That was insane. Crap. 
וואו, that's a revolution in recycling and environmental and everything. Okay, time to go. Okay, I should really fix that breach. No? Okay, before I go... I want that guy to fix my suit. Yo, operator. Where are you at? You didn't get sucked into space, right? Where'd you go? Fine, I'll make a new one. Requesting new operator. Transtar Cobalt Port. No, don't go anywhere. No, I need to go up. To the med bay. Diagnosing superficial injuries. Nothing affordable medical This won't take long. All done. Please fill out. Thank you. What was the point of what I just did? Talking. Is that a med doc? Med guy? Diagnosing superficial injury. Nothing. Great. Now let's get out of here. They say begin when both the US and Soviet Union make rival announcements about their intent to launch the first satellite. <sighs> Something buried here. Oh well. This is a malfunctioning recycler. Repair with six parts. No, I don't think that's worth it. I have two of them within his reach. Oh shit! Oh my god.
That was somewhat horrible. Okay, I'm almost out. I'm going to use those operators while they're here. Loading times are a bit much though. Oh my god, what the hell is going on? Wasn't that supposed to be clear? But you know, this is Sputnik 1, the world's first satellite. Nice. And the shadows are moving because the sun is moving relatively. Sorry, I need the parts. Sales division. What the hell? Oh my god! What the hell am I doing? What did we say about the EMP charge? Yeah, I should even... Maybe attach this to stuff. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Uh, everything is sucks right now. Ammo. 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 That's a lot of ammo.
the hell? What is the flash can? Can you turn off the music? Thank you. Ah! I hate it that the health bar is at the top of the screen. I can't see it when I'm aiming down. At least Alex isn't in my office. But medkit and eat something and recycle everything. Two new mods. Wait, what did you put in there? Test tube sample. Organic. Blech. Okay, I'm fine on medkits. I have new email? No. Shit! Hello, Morgan. This is LGV. This should make things. Give up. Make sure you're alone when you hit play. I love the look. You're not going to like what I have to say next. You have to destroy Talos One. The research, the Typhon, nothing can survive. Uh huh. Including you. I know how it sounds, but you've seen what those creatures can do. They're a part of you now. If even one cell gets back to Earth, we're lost. I'm sorry. I wish there was another way. January can walk you through activating the self-destruct mechanism. Alex will try to stop you. He's allergic to failure. Too proud to go back to mom and dad with his tail between his legs. So, it's up to you now. Good luck. Told you you wouldn't like it. You can't just self destruct, you need to launch it into the sun. Oh, that's January. Hi. Hello, Morgan. I'm January 2035. I'm an operator. There are many operators aboard Telos <clears throat> 1, but none of them are like me. Okay. Morgan. Yes. I'm your plan B. My first task was to free you from the simulation. Second task was to make sure you saw your video. Those are done. Interesting. New directives are now available to me. The self-destruct protocol for Talos 1 is activated by two arming keys. Your brother has the first. You had the second. Alex destroyed your arming key, but you hid a fabrication plan for a new one in deep storage. That's where you'll need to go next. We can worry about getting Alex's key afterwards. The Typhon are spreading fast, Morgan. You'll be racing against them. And your brother. This key card will grant you access to the main lift and all the labs. What was that glitch? Unfortunately, I wasn't able to fix the lift from here. There's another route through the psychotronics lab. 
Morgan. That lab is where the Typhon broke containment. Please be careful. Next topic. You asked me to provide you with more neuromods, which I've done. Good luck, Morgan. And what is that? Your office is right. Why did you do that? Play neuromods. And the psychotronics. Get Bellamy's room key from his body at Psychotronics. Relatively secure. Come back if you need to rest or use the fabricator. How many books do I have here? Eesh. And is that a Eyeball from System Shock 2 that you have there. Floating around the maglev parts, I guess. Tiny uh, altitude adjustment jets. Simmons installed blank neuromods on you. That's why you could remember the previous day's test and escape. Okay. I have your voice. It's a tactic to ease your natural suspicion. I'm sure you realize this. I mention it so that you'll know I'm earnest. <laughs> you instructed me to sabotage the test procedures if Alex ever failed to release you, or if the Typhon organisms escaped containment. Both happened. You designed me to assist you. I have more instructions, but I can't access them until you've recovered both arming keys. Uh-huh. Okay. I think this is a good place to save. And call it a day because I'm not feeling very well and I need to rest. So, thanks for watching. See you next time. Stay good. Have fun.